All right, so. You're wow, you're doing the voice. <laughs> okay, so voice. we're here at Island Rock. <laughs> I was gonna say that. It's their. It's the Rocket Power bouldering competition. Oh my god, you're totally doing. <laughs> you're not kidding about the vlogging thing. <laughs> So we're at Island Rock for the Rock Power bouldering competition. My first bouldering competition ever, but not Eric's first competition. So he's gonna tell us how this works. Each climb is assigned a score or like a point value. And then if you do that climb on your first attempt, you get the full value of those points. And then every subsequent attempt after that, you will lose usually 10 points per attempt down to usually a maximum loss of 30 points. They take your top five climbs, and then the amount of points that you accumulate determines how you're ranked. I'm probably gonna end up in the intermediate division, the three to four. I'm hoping mid-level advance, but who knows? We'll see, good luck.
time today at the competition. Um, I have a cold, my toes hurt. Um, hearing a lot of excuses. Um, my mom wouldn't let me come out to this. I had to borrow my friend's bike to get here. Uh, Alright, so it could be better. Uh, anything else I can think of as to why I'm not performing. I just went a little too hard out the gate and had two harder climbs on my scorecard and then two significantly significant, no, three significantly easier climbs. That's my main takeaway from the whole competition. Um, it's not just about climbing the hardest climbs. Um, you have to be strategic about the climbs that you're choosing. You have to just not get sucked into the harder routes and uh, climb something that's that you can do within two or three burns and get a consistent scorecard across the board in order to place. <laughs> um, yeah, so overall, good day. Had a lot of fun, learned a lot, think I'm gonna do it again and be more prepared, have better strategy, and hopefully do a little bit better. Okay, thanks for watching this. <laughs>